he took you out again last night? Sort of. Uh, sort of? <laughs> Uh, we got subs and ate them at the laundromat, so yeah, I took her out. Oh, you're not a fan of restaurants? Whoa, someone's a freaking millionaire. What? I'm a substitute teacher, so we each grabbed three on a six inch. We did. Mm -hmm. And you called this a date? Um, let's just say that the changing table in the bathroom didn't break itself. <laughs> we did. With Zex. <laughs> <laughs> Ow! If they come for you, boss, I'll take the fall. I thought I'd be the first in my family to go to college, but instead I'll be the 19th in my family to go to jail. Okay, no, Heather, you can't do that. Look, I'll confess to it all. I'll take the fall for you. Oh. Come here. All right. Come uh, oh. here. <laughs> That's my guy. Do you still want to get that beer tonight? No, or? no, no, no. Oh. See, I... I'm trying to make a plan to bang my high school ex as hard as I can. You know what I'm saying? Use our hallway voice <laughs> yeah, when we're so talking about that. I'm trying to set that up. All right. Okay. I want you to have this. Oh, see, you are very sweet, but I can't accept the Quinn satchel and oxblood with the side slit pockets. I'm late for French. Hi. Give that bag back to that sweaty little boy. Why? I think this is a slippery slope. Because he's sweaty? Oh. Slipping. I heard you say there's nothing you'd miss if you left Toledo. I would miss you. I think I'm just, I'm afraid that if I admit to liking anything in Toledo, I'll get pulled into the escalator gears and ground to a fleshy pulp. I, I, I like you, and I'm glad I met you, and I don't know, I, I don't know, you just you make me happy to be in Toledo. I'm just saying, I, I, I don't want to date anybody else. I actually feel the same way. You do? Yeah.